energy fuel use in Hawaii, uh, the slide that Scott showed you, those blue bars for carbonization that were kind of shrinking a little bit, this is the biggest, that's that blue section, that biggest section was the fuels used. We use fuels in Hawaii for various things. That top left section is electrical power. It's about a quarter. And the rest is transportation and some on-site use. Now, the first time I showed this slide in this auditorium years ago, the electric sector was a third, not a fourth. And that progress is being made in a sector that is maybe easier to get at. It's uh, monolithic grids, regulated utilities, and we have some uh, statutory uh, mandates. We have renewable portfolio standards, which require utilities to use increasing proportions of renewable energy as a fraction of sales out to 100% by 2045, and now being interpreted to be 100% renewable energy, not by statute, by um, uh, 2045. And energy efficiency portfolio standards. Now this is an old slide, and it's up here just to kind of frame the difference. The energy efficiency savings were envisioned uh, as part of the Hawaii Clean Energy uh, Agreement uh, initiative, where you had a projection of energy use, and they said 30% of that we're gonna meet with energy efficiency, 40% of it will meet with renewable generation, and 30% down to, so, so a 70% reduction. That was the HCEI 2008 framework. Um, here's where we are. Now, the time scale is a little different here, but this has built up the opposite direction because we know the fossil generation we can build up, uh, it's metered, and that is decreasing. The renewable generation portion has taken an increasing slice. That's measurable. The energy efficiency, what's listed here for energy efficiency programs is the measurable part of what Hawaii Energy has done. And of course, underneath that forecast line is a lot of other stuff like maybe uh, the state's lead by example, uh, uh, model energy codes, uh, price response, uh, appliance efficiency. But I think in terms of our uh, bending the curve, are we bending the curve question, I think you can say that in the electrical sector, we are making measurable progress that is documentable and identifiable. To put it in a longer term perspective, to get out to our goals, there, there you might see the bend of the curve going down there. So far, we're meeting the energy efficiency and uh, renewable portfolio standards. But just for perspective and sobriety, uh, putting this in the perspective of the whole barrel of all the different uses, those same two bands of renewable energy and electrical energy efficiency look a lot smaller in the, in the whole picture. And as the electrical sector gets to uh, take less and less of the oil barrel uh, responsibility, we need to have more and more focus on the direct use and primarily transportation. So that's one of the reasons the forum has, has decided to focus on transportation. You'll see uh, something else uh, here today. And if I were really brief, see, I could have just summed this up by just, you know, the, the three points that are up on the Hawaii Energy Policy Forum metrics site, which are we're doing well in the electric sector, but we have a long way to go, but transportation remains the real challenge for Hawaii.